Hey y'all, so I'm here with a Dollar Tree haul. This is mostly like food items and stuff. It's raining here, just got off of work. And so let's get with this. Um, they had a lot of like new, like, well, not new, new, but like new foods in there. Normally like the freezer section's bare in there. So let me show you what I got. So these are like my favorite. So I'm thinking about, um, I'm gonna have asparagus for work like the next two days. I'm just gonna take the whole thing, like each package. And then I'm gonna have, oops, I got two of those. And then I'm gonna have some bacon to go with it and just put it in the microwave or whatever. So I'll have those for a meal. And I got two of these chicken, chicken of the sea imitation crab meat. Um, I'm going to make something with that. I don't know what yet, but I will be making something with that. I got some of these sardines because I do like sardines every now and again. Um, and so does Isaiah. But these ones are the chicken of the sea. These are wild caught, wild caught sardines in water. There is the uh, ones in Louisiana hot sauce. Um in oil and lightly smoked. And then there's the ones in mustard sauce. So I got those. I also got some bread. So a long time ago, like growing up, we would make um, sugar, cinnamon, butter bread or toast or whatever. So I've, I've got that. I'm gonna make that probably here soon. Um, Cause they also had sugar cinnamon there this time. And I had some of it, but we like we've used it all. I got two of these smoked sausages by John Morrill. So since I had my freezer, I can just have these on stock or whatever. And then I got two of the classic Frank's hot dogs and I got some garlic bologna this stuff's really good y'all I just got one of those I got some cream cheese this is the level valley cream cheese oh this is the drink Let me show you this stuff first. So they had these cute little highlighters. Um, what's this say? League's best. And so there's yellow, orange, and green here on this one. And then there's pink, purple, and blue on this one. And these are just like perfect for work or, you know, wherever. They're just super cute little. And I like those, so I got those. Got Opal a squeaky, she loves squeaks like squeaky toys and she's had one of these before um and she chewed it up so yeah and i got a grape drink this is the sun kiss for dollar 25 can't beat that at all so i got that there's just not enough time in the afternoon after working from six in the morning until 4 15 like there's not enough time so it's like I have very rarely since it's like cold outside now like even and that like it, it gets dark so sooner I don't have time to do, like really do videos because for one by the time I get home I'm tired and for two since the time changed like hit when it's dark I'm ready for bed like mamma up here is ready for bed I could I could literally, if I didn't have kids, I could come home, eat, shower, and go lay down and be done for the night. Like, that's just, that's where I'm like, that's my vibes here lately, y'all. So, yes, that's, you know, that's it. Look at my shirt. Super cute. There's this sweet little girl. So, I was like looking down the makeup section and she's like, oh, I like your earrings. I like your shirt. I didn't realize she was talking to me and I looked over and her mom's like, she's talking to you. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I didn't realize that. And um, she's like, she's a huge Mario fan. 
Um, and she was like little bitty. I'm talking, she looked about three or four years old. And that little girl could talk, talk up a storm. And she's like, I love your shirt and your earrings. I'm like, you were so sweet. So I got some more cat food because I'm not, I didn't get any at the Walmarts. And who is this? I don't know, but they're pulling up here beside me. But oh well. So I got some of the Sunshine Cat Cafe. It's gourmet blend. It's got chicken, turkey, salmon, and ocean fish flavors. So I got that one. And also got the Nine Lives. It's a balanced nourishment in each tasty bite. So, chicken, beef, and salmon in this one. Um, also got two things of the Ru Russell Stover assorted chocolates. It's got milk and dark chocolates. And there they are. There's the back. I probably couldn't see that fast, but that's that. And then I also got some honey. This is the Isabella 100% Pure Honey Premium. All natural, no artificial colors, direct from Hive. I should have got two of these. The lady that is like the boss up here, um, she's on my channel as well. Like She follows me, so hey, if you're watching. But she's like, this is like actually it real honey. Really went off, but I know the, the one that has like the bear on it, it's not real 100%, but this is saying that it's 100% real, y'all. So I grabbed that one up. They also, now I'm gonna tell you something. This don't happen so much since my boys and my kids have gotten bigger, even my daughters. Now let me tell you something, even when I'd go to my mama's house, they would lose her silverware, forks, knives, whatever. I mean, because my kids would dig in the dirt. Like I done that crap too, but like, my mama's like, I don't know what's happened to my spoons and forks, but they're all gone. That crap started to happen to me and two, Sometimes if they're eating like food that's been like out, like say Mexican or places like that, they will eat out of the container. And I've caught them before and they throw the freaking fork in the garbage and I go back and look and I'm like, not necessarily meaning to because you know, like you're eating, you put it back and you just like toss it in there. And I'm like, dude, that's, where's my, that's where my forks have been going here lately. Because before, they would, when they were little, go out and play and leave them and lose them and Lord knows what else. But what I'm getting at is they have these um, Gibson home. They have teaspoons and dinner forks and dinner spoons. And there's six in here. So six for $1.25. You cannot beat that, y'all. <coughs> Just saying. And this is, I do believe, a name brand. So I got these because, you know, Lord knows what's gonna go missing. And I've gotta have freaking spoons and forks, okay? Just saying, just saying. Um, what else do we have here? So I got some more, this is more food stuff. So I got, some bologna um, by Oscar Mayer. I got to me two things of pickles for work. These are the Dilly Bites, and these are great. Got those. There's some more of the uh, smoked Polish sausage. These little things are good fried up. They're so good. I got two things of these biscuit slices. Um, it says it's cured with salt, white sugar, brown sugar, and sodium nitrate, sodium nitrate. Um, I've not had this kind before, the biscuit stuff or whatever. Um, so I figured I could make this for, you know, a breakfast or for breakfast for work or something. I don't know, I'm just trying to find stuff to take to work. Um, and then I got two of these blended um, season blends. It's got onion, celery, red, and green bell pepper, and parsley. So this is good to have on hand in your kitchen or for, you know, cooking or whatever, in your pantry, freezer, or whatever. Lord, I'm, I'm all over the place. Y'all just never mind me today. It's been a doozy, I'm telling you. It has been a freaking doozy. We have run around at work 
like a chicken with her head cut off. And when you finally get to go home, you're still running around. So it's like, man, it never ends, but it's okay. It's all good. I got some of these Wise Golden Potato Chips. These are the Honey Barbecue. These things are amazing. And these things would pair perfect with that bologna, like the bologna sandwiches. Just saying, because this stuff's really good, okay? I got some seasonings. I got a onion powder because we use the hound out of onion powder. I got some cinnamon sugar, which is the bomb. I got some cilantro lime and I got some citrus garlic seasoning. I got these two. Um, I don't think I have these and if I do, oh well, because we use seasonings like crap. And it, these are good for tacos and this one's here is good for fish, poultry and more. So, I mean, you can use it for whatever, but I got those. I got some Tosum Pop-Tarts. These things are good. These are the strawberry. And I got some Jello, sugar-free Jello. Now looky here, y'all. Dill tuna salad. Okay. So of course I had to get two of these. Dill tuna salad. I love dill pickles, kids. So I got those two. This salmon is really good. It's the wild Alaskan pink salmon. I figured we're like a bulled egg with this. Yes, ma'am for work and then I got the cracked pepper and sea salt which is also good so I got that too <clears throat> so yeah that is my good old Dollar Tree haul um I wasn't even going to come here but I was like I want to go see what they have um but like I said by the time I get home and cook or if I get the kids something fast food or whatever I decide to do it's already like right now, it's 5.53. And like I said, by the time I get home, do whatever, get a shower, boom, it's bedtime. So I've just, I've not been in the loop with videos here lately. Um, and I'm not gonna lie, I've just, I've, I've really not wanted to do videos just because I've just been so busy. Um, and I'm truly busy. And like by the time I get home, I'm like, Lord, I just want to relax, but when I get home, I normally don't relax, so that's just adulting. You know, when you're a kid, you're like, I can't wait till I'm 18, I can't wait till I'm an adult, and then when you become adult, you're like, hold on a minute, all these responsibilities and all this and all that, and I'm like, man, honey, you hear your parents and grandparents say, and your aunts and uncles, don't wish your life, aw your life away or whatever that like in a blink you know it's like you're, you're grown and adult here i am i'm gonna be 37 in april okay april the 7th i'm gonna be 37 thankful for it but time's going by quickly and it's like a blink and you're like here and i'm like man this is crazy um on another note and this hurt like the dickens i was working and I can't remember if I told y'all. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I told somebody today. But you see this? I literally broke. So it just wasn't the tip of my nail. It was the meat and all underneath here. I don't know if y'all can see that. But it was literally all of that. It hurt so bad and like I had to keep working and I couldn't like do anything about it. Finally in the evening, I got to where I could take, you know, clip some of it off, but it's, it's literally down in the quick, like you can see. So she broke. So my nails are jacked up now, which I don't care cause I'm about to be, I was hoping to let them go for another week or so, but you know, that's, that's unfortunate. I might make it Saturday. I'm, I might work Friday for overtime. I don't know. I might make it Saturday or I might prolong it for another week or two. Because, I mean, these don't look that bad until I break them. Okay? Because it's been wild out here at work. Um, but, I mean, they don't look bad. I typically could go another week or two or a week and a half. And that's probably what I'm going to do because... These things are expensive, okay? And this is like what I reward myself with. So I'm just gonna sit and enjoy the pink and purple and just call it a day, okay? 
but I'm saying it hurt super bad, super bad. But don't get me wrong. I do enjoy doing videos, but here lately, I ain't gonna lie, I've just been, I've just been busy. And I think where I've not taken the time to just like relax, it's been catching up with me because I worked, I worked six days last week and then I was off Sunday, didn't really relax. And then back to work Monday. So it's just like, I just, I can't, I can't seem to make and find the time to do videos, if that makes sense. I have reviews to do, like, I just have so much to do, and I'm always, like, busy with my kids and whatsoever. So, I'm just, it is what it is. So, but it's not like I haven't seen y'all in forever. I did go live, was it Saturday or Sunday? Sunday, I think it was, so. I don't know. I'm just used to like doing more videos and stuff, but a body can only do so much, right? Anywho, I hope everybody's doing good. And I'm loving this makeup color. It's pretty. Super pretty. A lot of people that, well, not a lot, several says that, says that it's orange, but this is not an orange color. It's more of like a pink or no, like a pinkish reddish, like burnt like burgundy top color but it's very pretty and i like it i got it from ipsy um which is now boxy charm but i got it from them a while back ago but anyways guys i'm gonna get off of here and until next time guys i will talk to you guys later and thanks for watching bye